What up YouTube, long time no talk, Nathan Heights here. Wanted to give you guys a quick little update. Today I want to share with you guys my new tattoo. It's pretty sick. Now if you've seen some of my older videos, you know that I have a lot of not so good tattoos that I got when I was younger. And since I've grown up a little bit, I've gone to college, I've gotten a better job, and I've been able to invest some more money in my ink. I got a couple new tattoos in the works and I really want to show them with you. Show them to you and with you, my people. So let's check this out real quick, guys. So the first one, it was actually inspired by some Advaita Vedanta uh, readings that I did. I'll actually show you guys. You guys wanna see the tattoo or the reference first? How would I show you the, uh, the reference first? And I apologize for the zooming in and out. I haven't figured out how to fix that yet. But the piece I got is actually a Jesus piece. And it's inspired by this photo here. Right? And I'm going to do this video in Spanish too. So if you're watching in Spanish, stay tuned. I'm going to do my best to, to provide this information to you in Spanish. But it's, it was inspired by this, this book written by some Swami. And... Uh, I forget his name, it's kind of hard to pronounce, but he comes from the Advaita Vedanta uh, sect of Hinduism, right? And they have ten temples here in Los Angeles. But let me show you the tattoo real quick, I'll tell you who did it, and I'll tell you how it went down. Give me just a moment, and I'll move my camera, and I will, that's my, shout out to my degree. So here's a piece that I got, right, can you guys see it? Oh, let me... There you go. Right? I'm going to do some sexy poses for you. Here, let me make sure that this is... As you can see, it's a Jesus piece in a seated position, meditative position, prayer hands, and uh, this halo in the back. So that tattoo was completed by my cousin. His name's Chris Paez. He owns a shop called uh, the Dolorosa Tattoo Company, located in, I believe, Studio City or Encino. One of those, I believe it's Studio City. And I'll post a link to his Instagram here on the on the page somewhere. It'll just pop up. It'll be the word. Won't be too fancy, but that way you guys can check out some of his work. And. Uh, yeah, he, he typically has a waiting list, but because of the whole coronavirus thing, I was able to get in there, snatch a spot. Since we're family, uh, we're close, we were able to, to get that done. But in any case, I also got another tattoo that's in the works, and I've been wanting to share it with you guys, and I will share it with you guys again later on, but it's actually my back piece. And for this one, I'll show you some photos. I'll just put them up on the screen as I'm talking. This first photo is actually the before picture. Uh, what I had before and it's actually a whole back cover-up piece which is pretty crazy if you think about it but this is the before picture and uh, here is the before picture and the first session picture the line work as you can see uh, it would, it's like a Garden of Eden piece um, with the snake and the tree and the uh, apples and, and here's a session of color And here is a second session of color. So we're three sessions in. The next session is scheduled for August. And uh, right now I'm looking at my camera because the battery is about to die. I'm going to have to change the battery real quick. But yeah, here's the, the third session uh, right here, as you can see. And uh, this individual is also a very uh, experienced and great tattoo artist, especially with his cover-up pieces. And I'll post a link to not a link but I'll post his uh, Instagram name here as well so you can see it his name's uh, Robert Atkinson he's he's been tattooing a long time he does a lot of like Americana type of tattoos I think that's what you'd call them but anyways those are the tattoos I wanted to give you guys a quick update I know I haven't been posting as much nowadays I got a lot going on outside of YouTube but I definitely in the back of my mind always want to post more to YouTube I enjoy reading your guys's comments and connecting with you guys so 
you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if this is the first video that you've seen. Much appreciation. And I plan on putting more videos out there as I get my next session and I get tattoo removal and, and stuff like that. So stay tuned, my people. Much love. Take it easy, brothers, sisters. Bye-bye.